Well, those wildfires uh, show that people just can't take on Mother Nature. So how do you stay safe if you're caught near one? KXY 4's Brittany Paris working for you tonight with ways that you can protect yourself. This long-lasting heat wave mixed with high winds and dry land is an ideal combination for wildfires. This year is probably the worst I've ever seen it. I've been doing the job for 30 plus years. I've never seen it this dry this early. Spokane Battalion Chief Dave Hayworth says the fires we've had in the area are late summer fires, which are concerning because we still have months left in this fire season. When a quick moving brush fire flares up, residents can feel pretty helpless. And especially if we got a little wind and really it can do a lot of damage in a very short order. You can make your property and family safer before a fire sparks. The National Fire Protection Association says you have to be proactive, cleaning up around your house by removing dead vegetation or dry grass, which is just fire fuel. As a rule of thumb, if it can catch fire, don't let it touch your house, porch, or deck. Said structures, just like vegetation, dry out. The NFPA recommends having an evacuation plan and practicing it. Also, pack a supply kit. They say during a fire, close all openings to your house, including vents and doggy doors, to keep embers from getting inside your home. Leave as early as possible so roads are clear for firefighters and stay away until they say it's safe.